Ladies and gentlemen, round three, we are back here at Bell High School. And this time, the Bell Tigers, the hometown team, are the opponent of the Colonels as they look to finish off this tournament with a win. And now the, f the faculty here at Bell will present the starting lineups for the Tigers and the Colonels. Both teams still looking for their first win here in this tournament. After being inactive in his last game, Ken Burwell will be back here. He will not start as the Colonels are gonna go with Mason Ruckman in the shooting guard position. However, Burwa will be active and able to play here tonight for MMA. Starting five for MMA is going to be Hunter MacArthur and his incredible shooting abilities. Jeremy Ansel with his leadership and incredible finishing. As well as Nathan Dempsey, his shooting prowess. Mason Ruckman, his big man game in the paint. And John Latenzer. Starting five for the Colonels and the starting five for the Tigers. Tigers here on their home court in front of their home crowd. Colonels looking to pull the away upset in the final game here of this Bell Tournament. On this beautiful Sunday, af sorry, Saturday afternoon as the temperatures are starting to warm up here in mid-Missouri. It's the Colonels and the Tigers. Tournament action begins now, live from Bell High School. And we are underway here in this one. Ruckman going to get the first hand on it. It's going to be tipped out of bounds. And so the Tigers will get the first opportunity at offense here in this ball game. And bounding the ball will be Miles Butler. Inbound passes to Lingo. Lingo guarded by Ansel. He's going to sling it off to the side to Robertson. Back up top to Lingo. He'll go to Willis. Lingo, the front man for the Tigers, looking to feel out this Colonel defense. Ansel guarding him tightly. Lingo back to Willis. Willis under pressure. The sling it inside. MacArthur got a hand in there. In the triple team, shot goes up, but a foul. It's going to be on Ruckman.
Baylor Smith, he'll shoot two and the chance at the first points here in this ball game. And the first one's good from Smith. And Smith's gonna go one for two, a fight for the rebound's gonna be one back by the Tigers. An opportunity here for more points. Up top is the front man, Senior Lingo. Slings it off to Robertson. Over to Willis. Lingo, step back shot, that won't go. Rebound there for Ruckman, his first. Dempsey and the Colonels will bring it into the front court. Ansel. MacArthur now Ruckman with room to shoot and he will. Ruckman, that shot won't go. Rebound there. Willis, over to Robertson. They'll go in the corner, Latenzer got the steal on that one. Colonels looking to make it happen. They got four on two in the offensive area. Colonels will slow down and set up a play. Inside MacArthur. MacArthur wanted the shot, he's gonna hold off for now. Ansel, now Dempsey. In the corner, MacArthur. He'll pull from range, that goes. Hunter MacArthur gets the Colonels on the board and it's gonna be from downtown. Never mind, they will say that was a long two. So the Colonels will hold a one point lead. 5.54 to go here in the first. Never mind again, ladies and gentlemen, sorry about that. They will say that that was a three pointer. So MacArthur will have the Colonels' first three points, and getting the score right back will be the Tigers. Locking us in at three. Here's Ansel. Looking for an opening. Ruckman now Dempsey. Dempsey open for three. That won't go. All gold inside the paint. They're gonna be able to get that rebound, but it's stripped away by the Tigers. They got numbers on the fast break, and they score. Caden Robertson, his second bucket here in this one. It's a two-point Tiger lead and a timeout for MMA. 5.19 to go in the first 5-3 lead for the hometown Bell Tigers. Colonels will take a full timeout, try to figure out how to stop this quick offense of the Tigers. Bell gonna go with a half court press. Very similar to what we saw when the Colonels played Cuba here in the first round of this tournament. Latenz are in the corner, under pressure. Slings it off to Ruckman, now Dempsey. Colonels looking to tie, possibly lead. Driving his Ansel, he puts up the layup, no good. Rebound reeled in by the Tigers. Here's Bell leading by two. Lingo. Slung that out to Smith. Now it's back to Lingo. Here's a three-pointer that'll go up and go down. Caden Robertson, he's got six of the Tigers' eight. Ruckman gonna take it all the way to the hoop, draws the foul, and gets it to go. No, they're gonna call an offensive charge against Ruckman, he can't believe it. Trying to figure out what was the miscue on that one, but Bell's gonna get the ball back after a great defensive play. Here's Lingo, fading away. That won't go, MacArthur battling for the rebound. 
and it'll go to the Colonels. 4.15 to go, 8-3, Bell Tiger lead. MMA trailing by five. Ruckman goes up, and that one will go down. Mason Ruckman, his first points here in this one. Here's Thomas Lingo. Shot faked by the big man, now a drive, shot won't go. Battle for the rebound. Ball's gonna be off Latenser, it'll stay with Bell. Here's an inbound pass. Smith, under pressure, he's gonna sling it out to Lingo. Lingo looking to drive on Ansel, shot goes up. No good. I think Hunter MacArthur got a piece of that one. Colonel's trailing by three. Ansel over to Latenzer. Leaves it to Dempsey. Now Ruckman. MacArthur, Dempsey. Inside Ansel. Goes up with the one hand. That won't go. Tiger's going to be able to bring it out. Lingo guarded by Ansel. Smith has to drop it off. Here's a three-pointer. That won't go, battle for the rebound. One by MacArthur. Let me tell you something, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, this is stolen away. MacArthur's gonna be able to get the rebound. Colonel's looking to move it out quickly. Hunter MacArthur has been playing some incredible defense here tonight. Been able to lock down Smith and get three rebounds thus far. Dempsey, and he's gonna draw the foul. Foul B against number 11, Caden Robertson. His first and the team first. Now we're gonna get a sub here for the Tigers. Number 21, Will Doss will be checked in for number 55. Miles Butler. Doss in for Butler. Dempsey, guarded by Smith. Slings it far side. Ansel wanted the shot, he's gonna hold off. Here's Dempsey, he'll pull from range. That won't go. Ansel fighting for the rebound, but it's gonna be taken the other way by Robertson with speed. Robertson's gonna get stripped from behind by Ruckman, barely keep it in bounds. What a heads up play by Mason Ruckman, and now the Colonels have a chance. Long pass over to Ruckman. MacArthur. Up top, Ansel, he'll pull from range. That won't go. Dempsey with the offensive board. Leaves it in for Ruckman. Under the hoop, Ruckman's shot goes up, no good. Offensive rebound and he gets it to go again. We've been talking about his presence in the paint and he's showing it off right there. Leads cut to one, Ruckman's got four. And sell. Open for three in the lead. That won't go. <laughs> Tigers with a minute to go here in the first quarter, leading by one. Here's a shot from range, that won't go. MacArthur with his fourth rebound in the game. Lingo couldn't get that shot to fall and this one's stolen away by the Tigers. Logan Stratman, looking for an opening. He's one of the subs that came off the bench here for Bell. There's a pass inside, now we're gonna get a foul on the floor. It's looking like it's gonna go against Latenzer. And it will. Foul be against John Latenter. His first team third. Far side to Lingo. Up top Robertson. Here's Stratman. 
Pass inside, shot goes up, ringing around, no good. Ruckman with the board. Dempsey wasn't ready for that pass. And that's going to be another costly turnover for MMA as they look to gain the lead here. Twelve seconds to go in the quarter. Bell looking to get the last shot off. Ten seconds. Tigers looking to move quickly. In the corner. Here's a three-pointer. That won't go. Dempsey's got it. Three seconds to get a shot off. MacArthur. And nothing off. And that's how we end our first quarter of play with our score. Tigers eight, Colonel seven. A lot of speed and a lot of defense here in this one with three more quarters to play to figure out who will get the win here in round three of the Bell Tournament. And Ruckman going to convert the three-point play. Colonels retake the lead. Mason Ruckman thus far has put up seven of the Colonels 10. Bell trailing by two. This one swiped away by Ruckman. It was tipped so it'll stay in the hands of the Tigers. Here's Robertson. Strapman goes to Willis. Willis over to Doss. Back up top, Robertson. We'll go to the main man, Lingo, who's going to take it all the way to the rim with the foul. And he'll get it to go. Three-point play, no good. MacArthur's going to reel in his fifth rebound. Robertson, he got the check-in for Latenser, who's got two fouls here early in the second quarter. Ansel leaves it in MacArthur. Outside Ruckman for three. That won't go. Robertson able to get the offensive board. Outside Ansel, his three-pointer. That won't go. Ruckman getting the offensive rebound. And Ruckman's going to get fouled in the paint, or just outside of the paint. Robertson, his three-pointer. That won't go. This one tipped out to Anzel. Colonel's having some great rebounding right now. Robertson, he'll shoot it again. That goes. If at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Colonels put up two three-pointers before finally making the third. And MacArthur with some good defense, not to foul, but the fast break opportunity is good. And now we're going to get a timeout, Tigers. With 16, with 6.13 to go here in the second quarter, our score, MMA 13, Bell 12, Colonels with the ball. Storyline of this game so far, the leading scorer is Mason Ruckman, who along with four rebounds has seven points. Robertson and MacArthur, they've both got three.
Here's Robertson. Up top, Ansel. Finds Ruckman. Here's Dempsey. Ansel. Thought about the shot. Robertson. Colonel's looking to move the ball. Under heavy pressure. Outside MacArthur. He'll drive along the baseline. Little floater out to Dempsey. Robertson sends it off the foot of the other Robertson. This is pretty interesting, ladies and gentlemen. We've got two Robertsons on either side of the ball, and they are both number 11. Here's a shot that went to Ansel underneath the hoop. And this one going to stay with MMA. On MMA's side, we have Ryan Robertson. On Bell's side, Caden Robertson, both number 11. Dempsey's three-pointer won't go. Ruckman with the offensive rebound. And Ansel's shot will go. Jeremy Ansel, he's got two. This one's stolen away by Dempsey. Ruckman got knocked down. Seems to be all right. After Ansel's shot, Colonels are going to get the ball back here up three. 15 12, 457 to go in the second. Here's Robinson. Ruckman, his three pointer. Bang! 10 points. In the game for Mason Ruckman. There's a drive now by Lingo. Shot goes up the other way. And the speed is there. Lead cut to four. Both offenses firing on all cylinders right now. Here's Robinson. He shot fakes. This one swiped away from him. Able to get it back. Tries to go behind his back, but he's stripped away by Robertson. His shot goes up and good. The fast break has been there all night for the Tigers, and they've been living off it thus far. Here's Robinson. Ansel, he'll take the three. That goes down. Jeremy Ansel, he's got five. Cardinals lead 21-16. MMA is going to put some pressure on. And they're going to make him pay for it the other way. No, the shot wouldn't go. Hunter McArthur, he'll reel in the rebound. He's got six of those here tonight. And Edsel's going to go hard into the bench as he's going to get fouled by Logan Stratman, team fourth. Stratman, that's his second atrocity here tonight. Edsel. One in Robertson. This one swiped away. Dempsey looking to gain it back. Bedlam on the court. And now Ruckman swipes this one away, but he's going to get fouled hard. Going the other way by Doss. Doss, his second team fifth. Here's Ansel. Dempsey. Robinson slings it to Ansel. He'll pull from range. That won't go. Long pass. Looking to convert on the fast break again. No good. Rebound earned back by the Tigers. Here's Robertson. Pass inside, MacArthur blocked! Hunter MacArthur, we've been talking about his defense, and he is showing off right now. Slings it to Ansel. Dempsey. MacArthur, he'll go from deep. That won't go. Reeled in by the Tigers.
Sam Willis. Here's the three. That goes. It seemed to be MMA. That's the shooting team this game. With Bell being the finishing team. But the Tigers showing a little action that they could shoot too. Leads cut to two, 21-19. Colonel lead with a minute 58 to go here till half. Cohen tipped in, checked in on the side of MMA. MacArthur, inside Ansel. Under pressure, he's gonna be stripped of this one. He's gonna be able to get it back and now we're gonna get a jump. Jump ball will go to Bell. Lead is two and now Ken Burwa is gonna be checked in. It'll be the first time we've seen him since round one of this playoff. Sorry, round one of this tournament. Here's a three for the lead, that goes. Back to back threes will give Bell the lead. Ruckman. He'll stop and pop from range. That won't go. Burwa unable to get the rebound and now fast break the other way. This game has been bedlam, just chaos on the court. Fouls going either way. Referee not calling a lot, letting him play it out mostly. It's been a very exciting game on both sides. Colonels trail by one. Here's Ruckman for the lead. That goes down. Mason Ruckman, his second three-pointer of the game, and he's got 13. Colonels lead by two with less than a minute to go till half. Here's Lingo. Lingo looking to drive all the way in. No good. Rebound there for Tipton. MacArthur. Colonels will try some speed now. MacArthur. He thought about it. Inside Burwa. Burwa is going to go up and they'll say that he traveled. Inbound pass to Robertson, Colonels will go with some pressure. Less than 30 seconds. Here's Willis. Willis. Under pressure, slings it far side. Three-pointer goes up for the lead, no good. Ruckman with the rebound. And this one's gonna be stripped away from him. Ruckman, that was his seventh rebound. Closing in on a double-double almost here in the first half. This pass gonna go nowhere near anyone. I guess Bell thought that the guy was gonna cut. No one was there to meet him and now MMA is gonna have the ball back with 11 seconds to go till half. Here's Ken Burwa. He'll fake. Burwa under heavy pressure, he's gonna get stripped. And that's gonna be a travel. Ladies and gentlemen, this game has just been absolutely insane. Number 11, Caden Robertson put up a half court shot with eight seconds to go. Pass behind his back, Ruckman to beat the buzzer, he does! Mason Ruckman, 15 points in the first half off an absolute dime pass behind his back from Hunter McArthur. Colonels will go in a half with a four point lead. What an exciting first half of basketball. This is what tournament play is all about. And we got another half of it coming to you in just a few minutes. So stick around. Second half action underway here from the Bell Tournament. Colonels holding a four point lead. Looking to continue this momentum here in the second half. In the corner, MacArthur for three. That won't go, offensive rebound inside by Ansel. His shot goes up and he's gonna shoot two.
foul will be against number 34, Baylor Smith. And so good on his first. We remember in the last game the Colonels played against Newburg, they did not score in the entire four in the entire third quarter. Good to see MMA getting on the board here to start the third. And so it goes one for two. Colonels leading by five. And so gets up, gets a deflection on that. And we're gonna get a jump ball. Cohen Tipton went behind his back to grab that. Ball's gonna go to the Tigers, but a great play by Tipton. There's a shot inside, that won't go. And Sell fighting for the rebound, it's gonna be an offensive foul against Bell. Colonels will get, Colonels will get the ball. That'll go on Baylor Smith again, his second. That's two fouls by Smith in about 15 seconds. And Sell for three. That won't go. MacArthur with the rebound. His shot will go down. <laughs> Colonels by seven, largest lead of the ball game on either side. This one's stolen by Dempsey. His third steal of the night. Ruckman got that to go, but they're gonna say that Dempsey traveled. Colonel's going with a half court press, trying to put some pressure on these Tigers. Dempsey almost got his fourth steal, looking to go all the way to the hoop, no good. Offensive rebound by Bell, shot goes up but a foul. Foul B against McArthur. It's gonna be his second, team first. Baylor Smith, his second trip to the line. Good on his first. Smith will go one for two, Ruckman the rebound. That's gonna be his eighth board. Long pass and a tipped in, he'll go up. No good, rebound there for the Tigers. Colonel's playing some aggressive defense. Double team will come, splitting the difference. Shot no good, Lingo almost had a great play. Gets his own rebound, Lingo goes up, and that'll go down. Justin Lingo, sorry, Thomas Lingo, doing it himself. In the corner, MacArthur, back to Ansel. Long pass over to Ruckman, open three. That won't go. And we're gonna get an over the back foul against Tipton. And now, and now Tipton will take a seat and John Latenzer check back in. Here's a pass into Lingo. Looking to convert on the fast break, shot but a foul. Ansel, he'll get whistled for the foul. It's going to be team third, Ansel's first. Caden Robertson for two. First no good from him. And one for two from the line. Goes Caden Robertson. Colonels lead by three. Dempsey. MacArthur, double team comes. Inside pass to Ruckman. Ruckman goes up and lays it in. Ruckman's got 17. There's a pass outside. They'll drop it up top. Here's Lingo. Lingo directing traffic. Lingo looking to split the difference. Dempsey's gonna get his fifth steal. 
McArthur goes inside to Latencer. Couldn't split the difference. This one will go to Bell. Shot fake in the corner. Colonel's playing some tough defense. Here's a three. That'll go short. Dempsey with the rebound. Here's a fake. Ansel, he'll pull from the top of the key. That won't go. Offensive board for Latenser. Latenser tried to get it to Ansel, but he couldn't reel that one in. The lead is Colonels by five. Under pressure, Lingo sends it away. Here's a little dump off. Back up top, three pointer goes down. Sam Willis from downtown, the lead's cut to two. Three. 3.58 to go, 31-29 is the lead for the Colonels. Up top, Dempsey. Corner to Ruckman. Ruckman for three, that goes! The answer for Mason Ruckman, timeout Bell. Ruckman's got 20 on the night. Well, we have a little moment of stoppage. We're gonna take you back to when the bus was coming here. Colonels noticed that someone was missing, someone very crucial to this offense. It was John Latenzer was not on the bus on the way here. Whenever Colonel players called Latenzer, he was still in bed. He got his timing wrong. When finding out the bus was leaving, Latenzer got to the bus in two minutes flat, still in his pajamas with a jacket over them with wearing his basketball shoes in a dead sprint from the gym straight to the bus. And now he is on the court here for this Colonel team. Well, something important to notice, Mason Ruckman, a rebound away from a double-double. A 2010 double-double for that matter. Shot blocked by Ruckman. Mason Ruckman. He got the start over Burwa here tonight. I think it's easy to see why. He's been the star player on the court for the Colonels thus far. Ruckman stolen away again. Ruckman's third steal. Here's Ruckman. In traffic, goes up, no good. Offensive rebound, Latenser. Ansel for three, no good. Battle for the rebound, swiped away by Ansel. Drops it off Ruckman, his shot, that goes. Keep going, let's go. Colonels lead by seven, what a defensive effort to get that ball back and score. Ruckman's got 22. Here's a pass inside, looking to spin out of traffic, shot goes up. MacArthur can't believe it. <laughs> Foul is going to be against Dempsey, team fourth, his first. Smith, his third trip to the line here tonight, no good on his first. Will Doss is going to be checked in for number 55, Miles Butler. Smith no good on his second. Rebounds there for Ansel. Under heavy traffic. Pass is going to be tipped away, but the Colonels are going to be able to get it back off possession. 36-29 is our score with 2.40 to go in the third. 
We've been talking about all season, the Colonels have been having trouble in the third quarter, but they've been owning this one thus far. Stop it, pop from Hunter McArthur. That won't go, the board's there for number 33, looking to work with speed the other way, Ed Bell converts. Baylor Smith. This Bell team very fast, very good at the fast break execution. Here's Ruckman. McArthur for three in the corner. That won't go. John Latenzer got up, got that offensive board. And we're going to get a backcourt violation that's going to go against the Colonels. Bell's going to get the ball back with a minute 57 to go here in the third. Front man Thomas Lingo is going to bring it up the court. Here's Robertson. Drops it off. Shot goes up. And the foul is going to be against McArthur. He's been getting himself into some light foul trouble here tonight to his dismay. Doss. He'll shoot too. Doss good on his first, leads cut to four, a chance to cut it to three. And Will Doss will go two for two. Down to a one shot game. McArthur will bring it up the court. He's gonna stop and pop from downtown. And that's gonna air ball, get nothing but net, but not in a good way. Minute 36 to go in the third. Bell's going to get the ball back, trailing by three. And now Hunter McArthur will take a seat. Checked in for him, number 11, Ryan Robinson. Up the court comes Lingo. This one going to be swiped away. Latenzer got a hand in there. Oh, sorry, Ruckman got a hand in there. That's going to be his sixth steal. Here's a shot by Baylor Smith that goes down. That's going to be six unanswered. Ruckman's going to fire from range. That won't go. Shot's going to go off Dempsey out of bounds. And now Bell, after trailing by seven, is going to get a chance here to take the lead. They put up six unanswered, catching fire between Caden Robertson and Baylor Smith. And MMA's got to take a full timeout to slow down and figure out how to strike back against this Bell squad. Just a few minutes to go here in the third quarter. And one more quarter after that to decide who will get the victory in this last game of this Bell tournament. Will it be Bell on their home court in front of their own fans, or will it be the Colonels decked out in their solid golds looking to steal a win away from the home team? Bell, led by Lingo, going to bring it into the front court. They'll work the ball around. Here's Robertson. Robertson's got to send it off Latenzer's leg. And it's stolen away by Robinson. And sell. This pass going to be tipped away. Smith's going to be able to keep this one in to Lingo. Only Dempsey to beat, and he will with one hand. That's eight consecutive points, an 8-0 run here late in this third quarter. And Robinson wasn't ready for the pass, so Bell's going to get it back. Colonels have a bad habit of giving up runs here in the third. We thought they had avoided it here this time.
but nonetheless, Bell's gonna put up a nice run of their own. Lingo. This one went to Smith and that'll go awry. 22 seconds to go in the third. Colonels trail by a point, but they'll have the ball. Hunter McArthur gonna be checked back in. No, scratch that, they're gonna put in Cohen Tipton in for Robinson. Here's Dempsey. Dempsey. He'll work it out against Robinson. Letenzer, down to five seconds to shoot. Ansel, he's gonna put up a floater that goes down. And that is how we end our third quarter of play with our score, MMA 38. Bell 37, Edsel beats the buzzer to give the Colonels the lead as we head into our final quarter. Eight minutes to decide the winner of this ball game and who will exit this tournament with a victory. You're watching Colonels Basketball here on the MMA YouTube channel. My name is Evan Schreier here with my associate Mason Kletchen behind the camera. And we appreciate you joining us through all this tournament action. One quarter to go here in tourney play. Inbound pass to Dempsey. And sell now Ruckman. Tipped it over to Ansel. Gets a screen. This one swiped away by Bell. Here they come, looking to work with that speed that they've been patenting all game, and they do. Thomas Lingo, the lead's back in the hands of the Tigers. Ruckman. Over to Ansel. Ruckman from downtown. That goes. Mason Ruckman, he's got 25. The lead is two. Lingo guarded by Dempsey, 10 on 10. That one just through the hands of Ansel, almost swiped away. They go back up top to Lingo. He goes up with one hand and puts it down for the tie. Thomas Lingo gets it to go. 41-41 with 6.55 to play. In the corner, Tipton. And sell now Dempsey. Guarded by Robertson. Ruckman, under heavy pressure, he's gotta get it away. Goes inside Ansel. He goes to Dempsey. Dempsey goes up with one hand and puts it down. Nathan Dempsey, his first points here in this one. Ree gives the Colonels the lead by two. Lingo looking to drive. In quickly, Smith. And Smith's gonna travel. And that's gonna be a big break for the Colonels as they're gonna get the ball back up by two. Latenzer is gonna sit down in favor of Burwa. And Tipton will sit down in favor of MacArthur. Hunter McArthur with only three points here on the night. A week ago, he put up 27. Sorry, he put up 23. Here's Ansel, stop and pop. That won't go, it's tipped off the hands of Sam Willis. It's gonna stay with MMA. Colonel's leading by two with six minutes to go. McArthur, Burwa, he goes for three. That won't go, Ansel, the offensive rebound, and he puts it in. Here's Lingo, drops it off. No 
Here's a three-pointer that goes up short, and Sell with the rebound. And Sell, that's going to be his 10th rebound of the game. Burwell's going to go up under pressure, and he's going to draw the foul. Jeremy Ansel, a basket away from a double-double. And now we're going to get a timeout here by Bell. Bell took the lead right at the end of that third quarter, but the Colonels got it right back with a buzzer beater shot by Jeremy Ansel. Since then, the Colonels have been slowly inching away as this is a four-point MMA lead with the Colonels about to shoot two. It's going to be a full timeout for MMA, but I think the story of this game so far has been Ruckman. Ruckman, his current stats right now, 25 points, 9 rebounds, 7 steals. He has been playing absolutely elite. And Burwell got on his first. His first points here in this ball game. And Burwell two for two from the line. Colonels by six. Dempsey playing defense on Lingo. This pass went awry. Dempsey almost got the steal right there. Little pass behind the back to Robertson, back up top, Lingo. Lingo looking to drive on Dempsey. He'll pull up from the fadeaway that goes. Lingo with another score. Colonels by four with the ball. Ruckman and sell now Dempsey over to Burwa. Burwa thought about the shot, he's gonna drive, now stop and pop no good off the front of the rim, rebound there for the Tigers. Looking to work quickly. Up top shot, no good. Burwa with the rebound. Bell, coach thought he traveled. He's irate over that one. Nonetheless, nothing called. Ruckman, now MacArthur. MacArthur under heavy pressure, looking to escape, and he's going to make a great play and send it off the foot of Doss out of bounds. 420 to go in the fourth. Colonels with a four point lead, 47-43. Latenz are gonna check in for Dempsey, Colonel's gonna get some height on the floor. He'll get the big man in the paint. Up top, Burwa, he'll shoot the three, that won't go. Swipes it away, Burwa's gonna get credit for the steal and now he's gonna be in under pressure, but they'll call the travel. Burwa trying to do his signature spin move. Was no good in that effort. Ruckman's going to talk to him, figure out what went wrong. Bell with the ball back. Four minutes to play. Lingo. Sets up to Willis. Willis, he'll shoot over Ruckman. That goes down. Great shot from the mid-range by Sam Willis. Leads cut to two. Here's Burwa. Burwa drops it off to Latenzer. He goes up and lays it in. That play was executed to perfection. Lingo. Tigers trailing by four. The slings went outside, stolen away by Burwa. Burwa to Ruckman, and that one swiped away from Ruckman by Robertson. 
Here comes Bell with speed the other way. Going all the way to the hoop and he scores. Forty-nine, forty-seven. This one tipped away by Willis. It'll stay with MMA with two fifty-seven to go. We're set up here for a photo finish here from Bell. For as crazy and wild as a game as this has been, it would only be right for it to finish this way. Pass went to an open MacArthur in the corner, right in his spot, but it was too low, and now Bell's going to get the ball back. No good off the front of the rim, Ansel with the rebound. Lead pass ahead to McArthur. He's gonna stop, and Smith with the steal the other way. Lead pass up ahead. Ruckman the only person in the back, and he's gonna foul in order to prevent the score from Thomas Lingo. And MMA is going to take a 30-second timeout. Fouls against Ruckman, hits second, on, team sixth. The lead is two with 2.28 to go. Colonels are going to talk it over. They're going to keep their lineup out on the floor as they have it now. That'll be Ansel, Burwa, Ruckman, Latenzer, and MacArthur. On the other side for Bell, it's going to be Willis, Lingo, Smith, Stratman off the substitution, as well as Robertson. Lingo good on his first. Lead cut down to one. Second free throw, a chance to tie. And Lingo goes two for two, and we're locked in at 49 here in Bedlam time. Here's Ruckman. Burwa. MacArthur. Gets a screen. Ruckman. And he's going to sling it to McArthur, who's going to keep it into Latenzer unbelievably. And now we're going to get a foul against the Tigers. Foul's going to be against Logan Stratman. It's going to be his third. Team fourth. Inbound pass to MacArthur. Up top, Ruckman. MacArthur sets up to Ruckman for three. That won't go. Ansel unable to get the rebound. And now Bell with a chance to lead. Lead pass, and Ruckman is going to get whistled for the foul. Clear frustration on that one. Thought he got all ball, but the referee will say he'll shoot two. Smith, this is going to be his fifth trip to the free throw line here tonight. That will be the seventh. It'll put Bell in the bonus. With as many times as he's been to the free throw line, Baylor Smith has not shot well from it. One for two, but it's going to be good enough to give the Tigers the lead by one. Ansel. MacArthur. Over to Ansel. Drops it off to Burwa. Goes to MacArthur. Makes a man fall. Off to Ruckman. His shot goes down. Lead back in the hands of the Colonels. Mason Ruckman's got 27. Stolen away by Burwa, but the Colonels couldn't come up with it. Lingo looking to drive, and now we're going to get a foul against Burwa. It's 
It's going to be a one and one opportunity. Lingo, his second trip to the free throw line. First time up, he was two for two. This one won't go. Battle for the rebound, won by Latenser. Colonels have the ball up one with a minute to go. And Sell looking to slow things down. MacArthur over to Burwa. Burwa driving on the baseline, and now we're going to get a timeout for MMA. 50 seconds to go. The lead is 51 to 50. We're playing Bedlam basketball here in Bell. The lead is one, 50 seconds. High pass ahead to Ansel. Colonels will be able to get this ball in play. Here's Ruckman, now MacArthur. And now we're going to get a foul that's going to go against the Tigers. It'll go against Lingo, his first. He'll get it in Ansel. Bell coach trying to direct traffic. We're going to get another foul. And it's going to send Ruckman to the free throw line. Nope, never mind. They will not send him yet. Next foul, Will. And now they've got a foul, and Smith will. This will send Mason Ruckman to the free throw line. The lead is one. Ruckman's got a chance to make it three if he can hit both his shots. Ruckman, no good on his first. Able to get the rebound of the Tigers. 30 seconds to go, the lead is one, with a chance to take the lead. Colonel's in need of a stop. Lingo, drops it off. Stratman, puts it inside. 20 seconds. On the ground, Lingo for three in the lead. That won't go, the rebound one back. Shot goes up, that won't go. Back outside, Robertson goes up. He'll get the foul. Robertson's gonna shoot two. One of them ties, two of them takes the lead. This is Bedlam basketball in tournament play. First no good. Robertson. The free throws to tie. No good. Ruckman with the rebound, and they've got to foul him. The referee is going to say that this was a jump ball as the Tigers were trying to foul Ruckman. Colonel's in absolute disbelief. So Bell is going to get the ball back now with six, six seconds to go. Baylor Smith was on his back practically mauling him. And the referees called it a jump ball as Lingo was on his front grabbing the ball. This 
This will be the third game this year where the ball will come down to the last shot for the Colonels. They are one for one in these opportunities. They fell as Dempsey missed against the Rolla Royals and they won with a defensive stop in the very last seconds against Wright City. What will happen? It's going to be Ruckman, Latenser, MacArthur, Burwa, Ansel. They'll be the squad out here to play defense with six seconds left. Another thing with that last Ruckman rebound, it'll give him the double double he's been looking for. Robertson with the inbound. They'll throw it inside. It's off the foot. Latenzer goes to the floor. He's got the ball. He's going to hold on. It's going to be a foul against Bell, and that might just about wrap this thing up. John Latenzer with the most physical play on the court all the time, completely laid out for that ball. And now we're going to get a timeout. And so a little shaken up at the end of that one. Just like we saw in the game against Silex, John Latenzer is always going to be the most physical man on the court. He saw that ball that was deflected off his foot, off the inbound, and immediately laid out for it full heartedly. And we are back here with the final two seconds of this ball game. Colonels with the lead by one. Latenzer. No good. The half court shot for the win. No good and the Colonels win in Bedlam. John Latenzer's defensive hold wins the game for MMA. 51-50, your final here from round three of the belt. Colonels will upset the Tigers on their home court. The one point win on the last play of the game and John Latenzer did it. Mason Ruckman, his final stat line for the evening was absolutely incredible. 27 points, 10 rebounds, and seven steals. He is your player of the game and he'll be the one to receive the plaque. as the Colonels will take a picture to celebrate with their consolation trophy. MMA victorious here against the Tigers. And ladies and gentlemen, from all of us here at the MMA broadcast team, that'll wrap up our coverage here of the yearly Bell Tournament. My name is Evan Schreier. With my associate Mason Clutch and Peter Didiker and Kevin Sankster from all of us, through these three games here from Bell High School. We thank you for joining us for all the action, and we are happy you are here to see this amazing finish here as the Colonels are victorious at the last second.